today and I'm on school holidays <sighs> I have an x-ray this morning and then I'm going to decorate my room for Christmas and I have dance later today but that's pretty much what I'm going to do today so I'm going to get up have some breakfast get ready and go let's go <laughs> and we have to wear masks because it is like for medical reasons we're kind of late <laughs> Place. We were waiting there for ages because the lady told us that we had to wait but then the lady the counter said that we could go so we were waiting for no reason but <laughs> that is okay. Turns out I had to get an x-ray on my jaw as well and it was really funny because the lady that was doing my x-ray had to take my height but she was really really short so she had to climb up on a stepping stool to reach my height to measure me. It was really funny. We are going home now and I'm going to clean my room and decorate for Christmas. I'm gonna put this kind of like tree garland thing over top of my bed and then decorate my rose gold Christmas tree. It is very messy right now, but here is the Christmas tree and here is the little, like, I don't even know what to call this, but the garland that goes over my bed. In here there is a whole bunch of Christmas decorations, I'm pretty sure. There's like all little ball balls and stars stick on my tree, so I'm going to stop. Let it snow and snow. Let it snow. off and the basket is empty I need to move that and I've just kind of got the stuff I got yesterday and my Christmas stuff I need to put this away in my cupboard and then I'm going to vacuum my floor I'm gonna lift up the rug and everything and then vacuum the floor this isn't a Christmas pillow but at the moment I don't have any Christmas pillows so I'm going to take out these pillows and put in some Christmas kind of colored pillows and then I've also got to my little gingerbread plush to put up. Gustav, what are you doing? Gustav, what? Stop, right there's a ball ball. Get away, go away. across here they weren't quite long enough to go like all the way but I still think they turned out pretty cute 
been decorating my tree with these color bubbles and the rest will be these little blue ones and like some silver ones. Powder sugar in the snow. Candy cane and mistletoe. Can I please get an espresso? Back to the heat in mid-July I was driving outside to that King Cole Everybody was asking why It ain't Christmas time But when it hits you, well you know Then December rolled over I'm now sitting down and I'm going to decorate to the mini Christmas tree And this year I've got like this aqua silver kind of thing And I think it'll look super cute on the rose gold tree Ring. Okay, Boomer and he said, you've been good, but I won't lie. The fire of Christmas spirit has died. Grab your friends and sing this song. It goes like this and it won't take a lot. No Here in my door, I'm putting up this red little Christmas stocking. I have a few of these little Christmas gifts which I'm putting under my tree. I'm going to clean up my dressing table and then finally I'll vacuum. And that is my room. I am absolutely starving, so I'm going to make myself a small smoothie bowl. For my smoothie bowl, I'm going to be putting in some berries, just like wild berries. I've got raspberries and blueberries there, and I also just got some frozen strawberries. And we also have this. It is grown in Tasmania. They are freshly frozen blueberries, so I'm going to put some of that. The tip for how I make my smoothie bowl so thick is you don't put any liquid in first, you blend it. If it starts to get runny because you might have a non-frozen fruit or something like that, you just keep blending and let it get smoother. But if you do want to add a little bit of liquid, just add a tiny bit of almond milk, milk, water, things like that. Just a tiny bit at a time just to make sure you get the right consistency. And that is how I do it. And don't fall for the mistake of thinking that ice makes it thicker. Ice does not make it thicker because as soon as you blend the ice, it melts into water and it makes it thinner and thinner. I'm going to use some fresh kiwi fruit instead of banana because the bananas are way too old. As you can see, it is really thick and icy, so I'll add some liquid. I'm going to put in a bit of Milk Lab almond milk. There we have it folks, our finished smoothie bowl. I'm going to be using my coconut bowl's gratitude bowl. Using the coconut bowl spoon. To top off my smoothie bowl, I'm going to be using this coconut and also some vegan chocolate. Finish with a spoon and done. Hey guys, I wanted to have a quick chat with you about Coconut Bowls. Coconut Bowls is an amazing eco-friendly company which I use for all of my smoothie bowls. Look how cute they are. This was the first bowl I got. It is the Way one which is back in stock now which is super awesome. They're so cute. There's also things like the Aloha Bowl which has rainbows. You can also get coconut cups, which as you can see, they are slightly different to the bowls. You can get different spoons and forks to match your bowl. You can also get coconut candles. This is a rough coconut candle that hasn't been sanded that much and it smells absolutely amazing. This candle has been sanded more like the bowls and it also smells amazing. As you can see, the candle has a wide wick here, which this is the campfire crackling effect, which it is quite noisy when the candle goes, which is so relaxing. As you can see, the bowls are about the size of my hand and they're perfect for holding like this. They're great for eating outside and even by the beach. 
One thing I love about coconut bowls is that each item is unique. See, one candle is this shape and the next is this. The bowls are a pretty similar size, but they are slightly different, which gives a cool stacking effect. Coconut Bowls has a deal at the moment. If you buy before the 11th of December, your coconut bowl will arrive before Christmas. Coconut Bowls are the perfect gift for anybody. You can put cold food, warm food, anything in between really. If you want to buy your coconut bowl, the link is in the description for the website and you can use my code in our 10 to get 10% off your order. These bowls just make your smoothie bowl go. Ooh. It has come to the end of another video. I wanted to say thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you're enjoying this Vlogmas series so far. If you haven't, go check out part six and seven or day six and seven. The reason why, I, why I've only done three Vlogmas videos, yet it's Vlogmas day eight, is because I'm going with the days in December, kind of like an advent calendar. So technically this is my third day of Vlogmas, but I'm calling it day eight as it is the 8th of December. Like I said earlier, make sure you go to the description and click on the coconut bowls link to get your coconut bowls with my code. Thank you for watching this video. See you next time. Peace out.